Let's talk about potatoes. A very simple crop to grow. And let's not overcomplicate it because on this channel we do not try to overcomplicate anything. We try to make it as simple as possible. And when you make things simple, sometimes mistakes can happen. So let's mis make mistakes together. Over here, I've got a few kinds of potatoes. I've been told that there are seven kinds of different potatoes without going into what's what. Let's make life simple. It's all about simplicity. To grow potatoes, as I said, this is a Yukon Gold. Sure. This is, I think they call it purple something. I do not know any, any of these names, but it's a potato. How to grow them? As I said, potato is a tuber. It's not a root crop. Whatever you see over here, I call chits. I know it sounds funny in English, but that's the word. This will be the growth upwards. The, eventually, once you put in the ground, there will be growth downwards, which will be the, the reg regular growth and from here as it grows upwards they will be new potatoes potatoes uh, have a long history and it, it potato is one of those crops that we eat that were, was domesticated from the mayan time uh, originally potatoes will be poisonous nobody will eat them so they figured out and you can go and Google it and figure it out how it was done. Today, the potatoes, they're sweet. They don't have multiple flavors. And that's the saddest part of potatoes. Potatoes are supposed to have multiple flavors. So this is why the six or seven kinds, people should grow all of them. Because there is a subtle way that they're different in flavor. Because of Mighty McDonald, only one potato has become big. And that's not the right way to see life. What we are about to grow today are different kinds of potatoes. And they all grow the same way. What do you need to grow potatoes? A bucket like this. I've got these buckets sitting around my, around my house because I bought a, a tree. Instead of throwing it away or putting in the recycling, why not keep on using it. So I've had these buckets for years and years now. And I'll grow potatoes out of it. How do I do it? What do I need? Nothing too much. So I've talked about medium quite a few times. Over here, what you see, which looks like brown, is soil, which is really out of the ground. It was pulled out of my ground and I put it here. What you see over here is darker and it is a mushroom uh, compost. If you go back over there, I have wood chips. And as I said, potatoes don't need too much. If you're overdoing your potatoes, you're making a mistake. Just go and buy it from a store. Okay, so let, let, let's start one. I'll put some soil. Not too much, just, just, just a little bit, and put a bit more. So one of the techniques uh, a friend of mine told me the other day, and I never used to do it that way. How to put potatoes at different levels. The mistake I've always made, or again, it's part of learning. You learn every day. If you're not learning, you, you, you're not a good gardener. So part of learning was that I will waste a lot of money on the soil that I used. I overcomplicated it, and that was never required. So let's simplify it.
part of something which many people talk about. If the growth is happening, chitting, you should cut it. Yeah, that's a good way to do it. Again, why make life difficult? These will still grow. And to say they won't is wrong. Because the reason is the amount of space it will need. So I'll start with these two. So if my camera comes closer to me, I'll put this over here. I'll put this over here. I'll, I'll show you a different technique of doing it. We'll do layering. And what do I mean by layering? I put those two over here. Again, a bit of poor soil. Nothing ex exceptional about this soil. And I'll cover it. Now give a bit of fluff. And you already heard it. And see my hand. How beautiful th this part of soil is. So put it over here. Now I remember I have one over here, one over here. And I did one level. Now let me go. And do a second level. Couple of inches apart, right? Come up with fluffier soil again. And I'll use the word fluffier. The reason I'm using that word is to make you understand you don't have to spend too much money. A fluffier soil or fluffier is, is the medium could have been hay, could have been anything. But it also do not need that much soil. The tubers, they grow in between. The root system will happen and the potatoes will happen. And that's it. We'll water a bit. We'll finish all uh, the pots over here. And we'll talk about it in a few months.